Once this order expires, I think I'll go resupply because 40% isn't that small. There's two defensive fleets kind of heading our way. Should I be worried? <laughs> hmm. They look kind of big. Instead of moving that squad into the hangar and having to redo setting all these planes up. I'll just move this one up front. Move the dive bomber squadron back to the hangar. Come on, you can already start moving. What? Why'd you go for this one? Okay, slowly but surely we're getting there. But a couple of things we need to do. Obviously counter these hostile scouts. Taking us a while to clear this deck enough to be able to deploy two fighter planes. Then we need to recover the airstrike group and then we need to send out more airstrikes. that launch and an airstrike these guys are pretty close so let's go get them Right, that's probably the best way to uh, set it up. I'm just thinking. Attack in defense of the next and previous maneuver plus 75. Or defense of the previous maneuver plus 150%. This way we're destroying all of them. Okay, so this way ensures all safety and ensures total annihilation. Pretty good. Launch aircraft. And after that, head back around here. And we can launch it straight away. That's pretty good. Yeah, we have 
three dive bombers and one torpedo bomber and a fighter. No, no, we're gonna have to deploy a fighter squadron. That's fine though. Are we gonna be able to do it before? You know what? Just to be safe, recover the planes first. And then we'll be able to get the required amount, and then we'll launch the airstrike. Okay, so we got everything figured out, so we'll just set speed to 2. Stand by to recover aircraft. Hmm, the really are heading towards us, huh? Sir, one of the landing planes has crashed on deck. You must use damage control to push it into the water. Get up there. Yes, sir. Well, that kind of threw a wrench in our plans, huh? Still. Oh, come on. The plane is all the way back here. We can... We can't send it back. Okay. Push it into the sea. Nice. Move the dive bomber squadron back to the hangar. We're gonna move... One back then land with the planes, that way we already have a fighter squadron on deck and then we're gonna put it into launching and we're gonna launch the airstrike in the meanwhile stop and resupply Stand by to recover aircraft. because we're moving towards enemies anyway which is not something I wanna do There's the ship coming to dock. Hopefully, it doesn't slam into us and cause some widespread flooding. I mean, I don't think we're undetected anyway, as there's ships pretty nearby. And that scouting party was above us for a long time. But mayhaps we'll be able to uh, ward them off. Yes, of course. Set it to launching. Prepare for launching. We're getting that resupply? I guess we're gonna get it at the end of the order. Stand by to start engine. That send them out. Oh they have a light carrier! Ooh wee. Pack of Maneuver 5 
and free is disabled. Hot damn. This one's gonna be pretty tough. This is going to be pretty tough to actually achieve. That one's pretty good. Okay, so all of our squadrons will return and three enemy units will be destroyed. These are tough. These are tough to perfect. Let's confirm the airstrike and then after that wait for us like round there and confirm. Okay, we're currently in launching. What are we gonna need? Planes, basically. We're gonna need planes, lo and behold. Admiral, a section below deck has malfunctioned. Send DC teams now. Where are you, uh, section? Ready, aye, aye. Go on. Have we already... No, we have not launched all the ships we needed to launch yet. Done the process. And we're still resupplying. Oh, we're at full. Admiral, a section below deck has malfunctioned. Send DC teams now. Yes, I already did. Get off my back. That air strike is ongoing. We're gonna need to deploy two more fighter planes. Squadron on the deck. Two more dive bombers and one more torpedo bomber. We're gonna have to fill our whole deck for that strike. But if everything goes smoothly, 
Uh, fuck. I probably... Hold on. I probably didn't target the carrier. Which means I'm gonna have to redo the mission. I don't remember exactly how I set it up. But, you know. Target that. Break. Or well, something like that. That one's pretty good, but only one enemy unit will be destroyed. Three to four, there we go. And we are targeting the light carrier. Again, sorry for having to do this again. Detected by the enemy. We gotta turn. Turn and escape. Right, give me more fighter planes and then dive bombers, right? Oh, but we have to. We have to pocket this. Torpedo Bomber Squadron. <laughs> what do you mean did not encounter an enemy? Well, that's kind of awkward, isn't it? Move the Torpedo Bomber Squadron back to the hangar. Okay. It's gonna be pretty close. We're gonna have to thread the needle between two enemy fleets. Because our planes somehow did not encounter an enemy. I don't know, I guess I sent them wrong or something. You're pretty slow at this deck operation thing, my guy. Speed it up. And the invasion time isn't even here yet. Well, we can't do anything anyways. So might as well speed it up. Can't be deployed at night. Do. Hold on. Is there something we can do at the bridge to help this out? The island, sorry. Can't find. No, no. Bad weather? I don't think night qualifies as bad weather.
Well, it's gonna be night for a while yet, so... I guess we're not launching that mission. Can recover those planes, though. So that's good, at least. went past them. Let's go into that optional objective. I'm getting more confident about using this UI and uh, managing the carrier itself. Of course, still make mistakes and tons of them too. But it's fun. It's goddamn fun. We're moving to an objective. We can't launch, launch planes at night. Ah, each crew provides an extra stop for aircraft on the flight day. That could be useful. And this one provides department slots, even when compartments are damaged, which is not necessarily something we need right now. So I'm going to reassign you. And you're also uh, fit for duty, which I did not see. So we're going to have two more slots on the flight deck now. Right. An objective has been completed, sir. You have completed an objective. All these can be deployed at night, which is fair. It's historical. The 15th of November 1942. Oh, the American way of writing dates. Terrible. Okay, we have a tactical advantage now. Neutral ships, unknown objects. We can't un identify targets at night, so. I'm starting to get what the active abilities of these are. Yes, I am hiding in place. What am I supposed to do? I mean, I suppose I can move there, but you just said that I have to reach there for a tactical advantage, and now you're telling me I'm idling. Well, what do you want? How far can we send an airstrike? remember correctly thing like that
I don't remember what we did last time that had such a good uh, stats. I guess you should start writing them down or something. But this strategy requires more planes than you can manage on the flight deck at the time. So you can't confirm it. Three units destroyed. I think what we had there was good, just destroy free units. And then might want to send another one out later. Confirm. I don't think they provided more slots on the flight deck, or am I wrong? Each crew unit. What does that mean? Each crew unit. Sections. Where's the air section? Sick bay ops. Because it was supposed to give us more space on deck, but it's not, unless I saw something wrong, which is, wouldn't be the first time. Well, I suppose off to the hangar as you go. while I try to understand this more. See what we can do in the bridge and on the island. Don't put them back in place yet. This 
Issue a torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. Issue a torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. Since you can't really save state of the game, the music was just going crazy this whole time. Okay, let's see. What were we actually up to? They were probably annoyed by the fact that literally just a second ago, you knew fully, okay. Neutral ships. So we are at the point we're supposed to be. Kind of. And we just launch an airstrike. Hopefully they won't all die. Was it fully launched? No. Start engines. We are just about to launch it. Okay. So <laughs> now hopefully they won't die. Hmm, what else was up? We can improve our visibility. Could do with resupplying soon enough. Well, soon. Scouting. Cap, yada yada yada. How are we with carrier speed? Put it on slow. And do we have... No, we only have one guy on navigation. That's fine. Uh, the bridge, the island. Keep saying the bridge. Yeah, that's fine. But we had said it wrong, but no. Turns out, past me, kinda knew what he was doing. But we have to get fighter planes and get some identification of targets going. Mm. Can you kind of set it like this? No, you have to uh, tell them to scout at the specific target, that's fine. Also, I don't think we had the range, really. Launch it. Ready, available. Uh, let's get some fighter planes up. Not always good to have in case we need to... What? Were those the ones that I just sent out? Oh, because they move! Right. Troop ships. Those are the ones that we actually have to destroy. So, since they move... Uh, wait, just hold on one second. But we can only send them at targets, we can't really send them ahead, so... How am I supposed to ensure that the airstrike actually hits the target? Like, do I have to be close enough? Unless this is kind of the path... No, this is where they're supposed to be waiting. Yeah, so I, I don't know. Uh, we'll figure it out. So, for now, troop ships. They don't have any special strategies, so let's just make sure we get them with as little planes as possible and... Let's put like... A high... Of the anvil attack it costs a lot of squadrons.
Not a goat. Four squadrons. Should be enough. Uh, all squadrons will return. We'll kill all the troop ships. And then wait for us like around here. Confirm. Also, you might want to send recon out there to make sure no troop ships actually slip past. So... We also need... Torpedo bombers, dive bombers, and one more fighter plane. Yes. Speed it up. Good. <laughs> I also noticed while I was away that the video also was already one hour and we barely did anything. Gam of whales. <laughs> okay. That's interesting. For that a day, for that a day, new cruise ship. Is there only one troop ship? Or is there gonna be more? And once we're ready, send them out. Launch aircraft! Are we in good positions to wait? Yes, we are. Honestly, just hold. Can you? Okay, I don't want to go anywhere. <laughs> How do I unset the waypoints? Right click on the furthest one. That makes sense. See, historically, you couldn't really stay in place because some aircraft had to be launched into the wind, so they had more lift. Submarine. Got it. Uh, but here, we don't really need to do that. Or maybe it's done, like, uh, automatically, because, you know, we're technically idling in place, but there may be some behind-the-scenes stuff going on. I feel like it would be, well, be realistic, but kind of an annoying micromanagement technique. <laughs> and before they introduce it later on. <laughs> if they do, sorry. I didn't mean to make it annoying for everybody else playing this game. Alright, troop ships. Target was identified. We launched that airstrike. It should hit them. Uh, also resupply. No, no, no. First... Get this submarine hunt going. Then... Set up some scouting. Stand then... Uh, take back all the airstrike squadrons. And then we'll see. Yeah, we are idling, so what? Sue me. Oh. Okay. Did they automatically take us back? See, here I was saying we haven't made any progress, and turns out we're almost at the end of the mission. Nice. Alright. Well, I suppose I'll have to cut those episodes together, and uh, I'll see you later, because there is another mission in the prologue. See ya.